Hi, this is Simple and Light Stuffed Portobello Alfredo. You need portobello mushrooms, zucchini or Italian squash, some baby tomatoes, some baby spinach, some roasted peppers, some thyme, and I'm using Gruyere cheese, but pretty much any cheese will work. Preheat your oven to 375 before you start, and then gently get the veins out of the portobello mushrooms. This can be a, tri be a little tricky, so take your time. Then coarsely chop your baby spinach. Dice the roasted peppers and have the cherry tomatoes. Then go ahead and cube the zucchini or the Italian squash. Get your thyme ready and not only do you want to get it off the twigs, you want to chop it up pretty fine. And I just put that right on top of the tomatoes. Then shred your cheese to make it much easier to melt. You want to saute on a medium high heat with some olive oil and some garlic. Go ahead and throw your zucchini in there or Italian squash. Saute the spinach for about a minute just to get it wilting. Then add your tomatoes, your thyme, and your peppers and saute them up. You don't want to saute them until they're super soft. You want to leave them a little cooked. Add some salt and pepper to taste. Then go ahead and toss them. Then, in a small saucepan, melt about two tablespoons of butter, add a tablespoon of flour, and let it cook down to get that floury taste out. Slowly add some milk. I'm using whole milk here. And then go ahead and add your cheese. Make sure you're stirring. You may have to add a little milk, more milk to make sure that it's creamy and can pour easily. Put your vegetables inside the mushroom caps. And then go ahead and drizzle on your Alfredo sauce. It looks so good. Then you will sprinkle on some breadcrumbs so right on top of the sauce and pop it into the oven for about 15 minutes. You want to make sure the sauce is a, a little brown and then the, that the breadcrumbs toast a bit. When you plate, just place it right on the plate and you can add a nice small sa side salad or I just add some crusty bread with it. When you bite in, you won't believe all the flavors. It's just absolutely delicious. The Alfredo sauce really gets through it, and I like the bread because it sops up some of that juicy goodness. Well, I hope you enjoyed as much as we did. Thanks for watching, and subscribe for more videos.